Hello dudes and dudettes, it's a really great day because the rune palace changes are here and embrace the variety my friends. And let's get digging on, this is really interesting changes to the existing runes a bit. And I'm really looking forward to these changes because some of the sets are going to become more balanced and some of the changes are going to make uh, some of the existing ones weaker, okay. And Riot is going to do a 30% off rune IP boost sale that will last from this start of the next patch to end of April. And this is really interesting also. So, you know, let's get started digging on the changes actually of what this patch will bring. And starting with the seals, um, the flat armors have been reduced um, quite a lot. So from around 13 armor, rounded up um, from 9 seals, you get now 9 armor instead of 13. And so with the 1 armor per rune, um, this will automatically mean that armor flats are no longer the initial choice anymore. I feel it's it's actually not anymore so good because all champions will gain 4 base armor compensation. So it's not that much you benefit from it anymore as you did before. Um, this is really good for junglers who want to really pick something else on the jungle, maybe health or health region. And here we come to scaling armor. I talked about this before, why, why I like these runes. I'm glad that I bought them because they're now buffed. Um, I really feel that scaling armor is going to be really good on the jungle right now because you get the 4 base armor bonus and you get a higher armor from the scaling armor round. 3 points is actually quite a lot. And this will mean that scaling armor is going to be very likely to be seen on many comp, uh, comp sets. And expect to see an LCS and expect to see in many builds. I feel scaling armor is the thing right now. I would probably, I have to do some testing, but I feel scaling armor is going to be 80% of the cases better than the flat armor. And then we got changes to the flat health. Um, this is a huge boost. I guess like a champion like Sona can really benefit from having flat nine seals. Um, 72 from 48 is a huge difference. I feel honestly that this is going to make a huge impact for those squishy champions. Um, I'm still not sure do I want to choose it from beside of armor, but those who don't want to choose scaling armor can just take health, and this is great for it. Uh, then we have scaling health, which pretty pretty much means that, well, it's the same thing, everything buffed. But I feel scaling health is also good, but you really need to look at the early numbers. Can you really? You know, in a, especially in jungle, can you really sustain with scaling health at the moment? I don't think so. And health region is buffed. This is a great thing. Um, I don't think it's still that very strong though. I still prefer the other four. Maybe the armor one is kind of falling off. But health region is extremely like a situational. Maybe for a support, I would choose it. And that's for scale. That's for the seals. And overall, I'm really pleased that these changes are happening and we will see what will happen to the metagame. Then we got the glyphs. Pretty much all CDR runes are buffed. Um, I felt really strongly that they weren't like the most best situation. Um, at the moment this is like 15% at level 18 is really strong. There are certain champions that really benefit from this and you can skip out a whole new item do need to build like a theme necessarily. It's still a good item, although. Although, but I see a lot of champions using the 15% cooldown reduction. Um, this is really good. Um, this was really interesting. So scaling magic resistance got buffed. I thought it was going to be nerfed, but um, I think they nerfed it at some point. They're kind of putting the numbers back to where where they were. Um, this kind of means that assassins on lane have better time against mid laners, I guess those who don't want to run, run flat magic resistance runes but now especially I just don't see any benefit running the flats um, really good for Gale Galio um, I'm looking, for, uh, looking forward to make that guide soon uh, mana region not a really big buff um, it's a small buff but still I wouldn't choose the mana regions it's not too huge then we have scaling mana region kind of the same thing the numbers are a bit better scaling I guess from the scale to, compared to the flats but I still strongly feel that um, it's it's not going to be better than the scaling magic wisdoms or CDR at the moment. I think the CDR is going to be a huge thing for supports at the moment. 
Then we go to Quintin says um, same thing the CDR treatment. Um, those who really desperately need CDR can take it and you can maybe get another extra item because you're choosing CDR. Maybe like a champion like Vagar who doesn't really need AP can really benefit from having cooldowns because he has a like practically his, his only kit is probably based on having ultimate on out of CD. Um, so I'm doing for the scaling cooldown reduction I kinda have to play around but these are really big numbers like 3 quintesses 15% level 18 you get 30% from the cliffs and the quints that's a huge number um, attack speed got buffed I guess this is kinda like uh, this is kinda like an um, to compensate the lifesteal nerf okay I can see every ID carry picking tr like 3 lifesteals I don't see any worth taking lifesteal anymore they compensated with the fees restoring to health for the minion up from 2 um, really interesting um, overall I feel the attack speed will be better for the junglers like maybe maybe Nocturne maybe some certain jungles who have like slow clearing speed can clear now a bit faster but overall I feel these attack speed chains are really interesting and this is going to be really beneficiary from those champions too maybe Trindamir can benefit from the attack speed as well but lifesteal um, it was a really favorite choice everybody liked to run 2 lifesteal queens and 180 so maybe everyone will just pick 380 runes or maybe just transition to attack speed but not every AD carry in this game like Ezreal um, or Corky is not attack speed based so I don't see them choosing the attack speed runes so, though um, check out my other stuff you know check out my guides you know nice we will see what happened with these runes pretty cool pretty cool stuff cool leos cool beans um, see you later alligator